before a train can take the tracks, before a single passenger boards, before even the vaguest sign of steam happens, there's an awful lot of preparation needed to run a railway. Which is exactly what this group of teenagers and 20-somethings have been finding out behind the scenes and beside the engine sheds of the Fastidiog Railway this week. They've just come to the end of their Kids Week, something that started off as a clever idea 21 years ago and since then has turned into an institution. We have senior kids, people who were here in the earlier days, 21 years ago, who are now coming back and helping. Um, and they're carrying on, sharing their skills, sharing their experience. We have many kids who've been through the mill, for want of a better expression, on Kids Week, who now volunteer in other parts of the railway. Some people who turned up as teenagers ended out having careers running the railways. You don't need to wait and watch that long at the Fastidiog's Boston Lodge works to see just how hands-on the whole idea is, whether it's really shining up the engines, helping to put coal in the firebox, or simply learning how to mix concrete. They've left their mark this year too. We've been doing a bit of painting and the concreting here, and we've been, we've been at the back of the yard clearing a few bushes and things. It's, been a bit quite a busy week actually so it's a great thing to do to volunteer to just be a part of you have not doesn't sound like you've sort of even touched an engine yet during the course of the week no i haven't and this weekend they're having a special party to mark the coming of age of this project 21 years of the railway kids rob shelley wales tonight port Maddock.